to relive those days? Is it possible to step back and into those times when there was no time for remembering what normal life was like? Those days when we adapted to chaos and struggled for survival? Benjamin answered, I can bear the conditions in the camp only if I am forced to immerse my mind totally in an effort. To quit smoking requires this effort, and it will therefore save me. The apocalyptic atmosphere in Marseille in 1940 produced its daily absurd story of attempted escape plans around fantasy boats and fable captains. Here I have a lapse of memory. The world was coming apart, I thought. Now how did he get here? To the Slavic culture it's grounding. From the bistro, we went for a walk so that we could talk without being overheard. Since my arrival here at the border region last week, I had found a safe way to cross People say the word Odradek stems from Slavic origin, and it points to the Slavic culture as its grounding. Then again, others say it stems from the German, then from Slavic, really by influence. The uncertainty of both interpretations justifies a conclusion that neither applies, especially since the origin of the word cannot be located in either context. I had started by going down to the port and chatting with some of the long One of them led me to the Union store. No one, of course, would occupy himself with such studies if there were not a creature called Odredek. At first glance, it looks like a flat star-shaped spool for thread who would help me find a safe road for those of our family and friends who were ready to cross over. They are only old, broken-off bits of thread, knotted and tangled together, the most varied sorts and colors. But it is not only a spool, for a small wooden crossbar sticks out of the middle of the star, and another small rod is joined to that at a right angle. By means of this latter rod on one side and one of the points of the star on the other, the whole thing can stand upright as if on two legs. That will be all right, Benjamin said, as long as it is safe. I do have a heart condition, and I will have to walk slowly. Ticklish situation. You want to take the risk? Yes, he said without hesitation. The real risk would be not to go. Glancing at him, I remembered that this was not Benjamin's first attempt to get out of the trap. I noticed that Benjamin was carrying a large black briefcase, which he must have picked up when we had stopped at the end. It looked heavy, and I offered to help him carry it. This is my new manuscript, he explained. But why did you take it for this walk? You must understand that this briefcase is the most important thing to me, he said. I cannot risk losing it. It is a manuscript that must be saved. It is more important than I am. Here we I sat down and rested for a no while. One, of course, would Here I had him being stretched out on the grass and closed his eyes. Here I have a and I thought it must have been tired. Like Here I have one is tempted to believe that the creature once had some sort of intelligible shape and is now only a broken down remnant. Yet this does not seem to be the case. At least there is no sign of it. Nowhere is there an unfinished or unbroken surface to suggest anything of the kind. The whole thing looks senseless enough, but in its own way perfectly finished. By means of this in any case, closer scrutiny is impossible, since Odredek is extraordinarily nimble and can never be laid hold of.
tops of memory. People say the word he lurks by turns in the garret, the, the stairway, the, the lobbies, the entrance hole. Often for months on end, he is not to be seen. Then he has presumably moved into other houses. But he always comes faithfully back to our house again. Especially since the origin of the word cannot be located in either context. No one, of course, would occupy himself with such studies if there were not a creature called Odredet. At first glance, it looks like a flat star-shaped spool of the thread, and indeed they are only old, broken-off bits of thread, knotted and tangled together, the most varied sorts and colors. But it is not only a spool. I sat down and said, then I too will stay. He smiled. Will you defend me against your wild rolls? one side and one of the points of the star on the other. Then from Slavic, merely by influence. On paper, it looked like an easy walk I had said. But it seems that we had one of their conversations then I mean he had laughed. Revealed that he quit smoking a few On the other side of the mountains, it was painful. He now suggested that we take wrong timing and do the first part of Enemy's inability to whether we would find our enemies of outer life. You go out to the cemetery here, like he said. Pointing it out on a sketch, then you return and, and check it out with me. But it is not only a spool, for a small wooden cross bar sticks out in the middle of the sky. Life was adversity. It sounds rather like the rustling of leaves, and that is usually the end of the conversation. Even these answers are not always forthcoming. Often he stays mute for a long time, as wooden as his appearance. I ask myself to no purpose what is likely to happen to him. Can he possibly die? Anything that dies has some kind of aim in life, some kind of activity, which is worn out. But that does not apply to Odredek. Am I to suppose, then, that he will always be rolling down the stairs with ends of thread trailing after him, right before the feet of my children and my children's children? He does no harm to anyone that one can see, but the idea that he is likely to survive me I find almost painful. He guessed why I stared. And it points to the Taking off his glasses, he said, then oh, again, that. Others say it's a morning to the ear air of mine. The path inside the nails is a mere. The spine hike of mine. The spine justifies a conclusion that I have a lot. False say du bras. False say du bras. Here I have a lapse of memory. No one, of course, would occupy himself with such studies if there were not a creature called Odredek. At first glance, it looks like a flat And he went on at the same steady pace. He had calculated and worked this out during the night, he had told me. With this timing, I will be able to make it to the end. I rest at regular intervals. I must rest before I become exhausted. Never spend yourself. People say the word Odredek stems from Slavic origin to the Slavic culture. Then again, others say it stems from the Both interpretations justifies a conclusion.
The nature of his strength, Walter Benjamin once wrote, is patience conquerable by nothing. Reading this years later, I saw him again walking slowly, evenly along the path, and the contradictions within him lost some of their absurdity.